Congratulations, my best governor, Governor Hope Uzojima. Congratulations, sir. Congratulations, Congratulations, Governor Hope. Hope. Congratulations, Governor Hope, Governor of the Year in Nigeria. We in the UK see your good work. Congratulations, Governor Hope, for Governor of the Year. Uh, we love what you're doing here from the UK. Congratulations, keep it up. We see what you're doing. Well done. Congratulations, Governor Hope. I wish you all the best. Congratulations, Governor Hope, as Governor of the Year. We love what you do in MA State, Nigeria. Shout out from the UK. Congratulations, Governor of the Hope. Governor Oza Dema. Congratulations. Uh, we see what you're doing out there in Nigeria. It is very good work. And uh, for the Imu, Imu state, that is uh, magnificent work you're doing out there. It's well appreciated. We see it out here in the UK. Enough respect for that big man. Love. Congratulations, Governor Hope. Congratulations to Governor Hope. Was Adin, Governor of the Year. We in Great Britain are very proud to hear of this award and your significant achievement. Many, many congratulations, sir. It's thoroughly well deserved by the way in which you have put your state first and provided your state and its people with so many wonderful infrastructure and life enhancing projects. The deserve award you've had is in thorough recognition of this. And so we congratulate you time and time again. Very well done. And if I may allude to just some of those um, achievements that you've... Yes, great people, great people. I am back again today. I hope every one of you just listening to what these people are doing to people of Biafra. You know, sometimes whenever I'm telling my people that... There is some people, they don't want us to have our freedom. You see British people, British people don't want us to have our freedom. Now, let me shock you people, because we have to understand all those things that these people just did. You see all of them, they gathered together. They were given a word to hope, most of them, they say a lot of things. But I want you people to understand that those people you see, those paid people, because they are agent, they are paid people. Imagine that these people are living in England where they have, I mean, social help. Where they have, if you don't have a house, they will give you a house. We are a place that people collect money every month without working. A place that whenever you seek, you will go to hospital without paying. A place that there is a work for people to do. There is already a motorable road, good water, good facilities around them. Environment, good environment. Now, do you see how they deceive our people? And this award you are seeing, it have already made waves. In England, and you see, even though an old fool, an old woman came out, we just saw it on this video. She was vomiting nonsense from her mouth. This woman don't know that old woman don't even know where Africa is. She don't even know where the continent that Nigeria belongs to. She don't even know. An old woman that has no teeth anymore was there praising hope. Can you tell me what, you know, oh my God. We, we are finished. We are finished. If we don't come together as one people, we all know what is happening today in Imo State. We know how hope is inviting Fulanese on uniform. Or in uniform, I mean to say. Parading themselves, kidnapping, maiming, destroying. Hope, who's the man came out last time, begin to open his mouth, said, the killings that is happening in Imo State was not the IPOB. That is a, 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 a something, a political issue. Why some people are in London 
and they don't know exactly what is happening in Africa because they are paid people. You know, may God have mercy upon all these people. May God have mercy upon them. May God have mercy on them. May God have mercy on these people that have come to destroy, to rule us, for us to remain slave forever. That is why you see today, you see some young white ladies coming out to praise hope. Also, them, they haven't been in Imo State before. These people, their leg never crossed Africa before. Their leg never stepped in Nigeria before. But they are there praising hope. Also, them, giving hope. Also, them, man, a word. And these people, they are living on their comfortable zone. And this time around, these people have these people have finished us. Now they are using white Caucasian. They are using some idiots. They are using some homeless people in England. I'm living in Europe today. I know how England is. I've been there. Go there, very dirty place. They have mad people everywhere on this dirty place. All their streets are very dirty. Go to London and you will confirm what I'm saying. Those of you that have documents, go there and see what I'm talking about. They now went there to gather some homeless idiots. Now come to begin to promote hope, also them man. Saying that hope, also them man, is working in Imo State. That they have put in Imo State first. These people don't know how many people that hope, also them man, is killing every day. These people don't even know. They don't have even no idea. It's like this thing that happened last time. They go and pay some people to come and begin to work on Buyari. All these people don't even know what is going on. These people don't know how many people are dying every single day in that zoo. These people that you see, they were pale people. This is the problem we have today. And this kind of news, BBC will carry it. CNN will carry it. That whole post of the man is doing well. Why these people never even step their foot into that contraption we are talking about to see what is going on? Go to Imo State, Imo State today. Imo State is catastrophic. Imo State is a place that guns and bullets are flying every single day. They are naming people. Blood is everywhere in Imo State, everywhere. And these people, to be in case, the world have to know this, that some people in their comfortable zone, they are the cause of our problem. You see all these people, we must make sure that we make this video viral to let all those individuals that showcase their faces begin to give a word and to praise hope those are them about the killings and maiming and destruction that is happening today in Imo State. They are there in their land where is a free education, free job for you to work, good environment, good hospital, motorable road. When you sick, they will take you to hospital. Without, you, without paying, you can never pay anything. If you need help, you go to social. Social will help you. Every money that is a place you will go and collect food without paying. Now, these people now are now in London, in their comfortable zone, now telling us that hope oh, of them is governing the emo light well. You see how they have finished us. These people have they have gone beyond repair, and that is the reason why we have to stand. That is the reason why we have to fight this battle till the end. That is the reason why we must confront our enemies. That is the reason why we can never stop on this quest of self-determination. Because they have already destroyed our people. They have already used our people. This news will be flying everywhere and they will be praising hope of them. Why hope of them is Islam in Imo State killing our people every single day. Because of Fulani people. Giving the full and our land and the white people they are in their comfortable zone in England, in London, living fine, going work and coming back with security everywhere. They are not there now. Praising hope of them in our land that are killing our people. My people, I don't know what to say anymore. Our people, what is wrong with our people? Look at them. They have buy our people. They are now buying international people. They are now buying, paying huge of money to international people, to homeless people. All these people you saw, or we just see on this video, they are all homeless. I am not lying to you. I'm living in Europe for a long time. 
They are all homeless. They went on the street and find them and give them some small money for them to come out and say that Hope Uzodema is the finest. Why Hope Uzodema is there destroying our properties, killing our people, kidnapping and doing all manners of evil to our people. And why some people are in London? The world have to hear this. UN have to hear this. European Parliament have to hear this. Joe Biden have to hear this. United uh, United States have to hear this. Also, House of Commons have to hear this and see what their people are doing against those that are fighting for their freedom or those that are trying to make their land to be to be I mean to be okay. Why some of your some of Boris Johnson citizen Boris Johnson citizen are in England on their comfortable zone where the security is. Why they ha where they having three square meal every single day without paying any money? They are now there. Telling us what is happening in our land is a lie. This is exactly what they are telling us. They are telling us that all these things that we are showing on media, we are telling people that it's happening on in the in Imo state. They are telling us that they are all lies, and this is how they will begin to fly all this news. And by the time they will kill our people and are kidnapped, and nobody will ever say anything about us. That is why we have to make sure that this video gets to everybody. For them to know that they are liars. They are liars. All these people, they are street people. They are, they, they, I mean, they are just nobody. They have no job. They are homeless people living on the street. Because when you go in England, England is exactly like Africa. When you go in there, England, in that London, just go to London and see how tattered and dirty every place is. You see mad people sleeping on the street. Homeless people, they are everywhere. Now they went there and paid some people and begin to say and call on hope. Both of them, even though an old woman that's still living on the street has no more teeth, that is alive, is about to get to grave. He, they, she couldn't even try to read. They don't care. They don't care about you as far as they have paid the money. They are street people. They are homeless people. They has no job at all. This is the people that depend on social money. Now they have gathered them. They are beginning to tell us what is happening in our land. Now you are waiting. Now you see, they are telling us our stories. And that is something that I am here to debunk. I am here to debunk. That hope, who's on them, is the worst governor that ever governed Imolite, or still on the seat right now. We want to tell the world that hope, who's on them, is number four governor position that make his way through the government, through the uh, uh, what they call it, through the uh, uh, um, be, be, court. Abuja made him, Supreme Court made him to get to the number one. He stole in the mandate from somebody called Ihedio. He stole the mandate from him because of his doing the bees of Fulani. Because the Fulani is his master and he is a boy to Fulani. He's stolen it. And today they are telling me something that can never happen in England. Something that can never happen in England. But now they have taken it. Telling us that they hope who's of them have built infrastructure. That hope who's of them have made himself known. Put his state first. Oh my God. I will stop here. I'm so I'm so angry this time around. I cannot take it because all this thing is the way they keep on dividing us and ruling us. And when the world will see all this, they will say it's true. The man is working. They don't even want to hear from us. Those that are passing through all this evil. They don't even want to ask. Now they are calling people that they are in London. They are in London. Enjoying free everything. Free food, like I said. Though their place is very dirty, but they have some people that can also organize and be giving them free food. They are homeless people. They have no... You see the old woman with crushes. No home. Then she has no home. All of those ladies that you see there, some of them are from... The, even though they don't know anything about Nigeria at all. They just see them on the street. Just call them, give them some small money. Five euro, ten euro on the street. For them to just caption them on the camera. And begin to tell us what evil the whole pose of them is doing today in our land. But they are telling us that he's working. Now you understand. 
we have a lot of enemies we have a lot of enemies and we must make sure we defeat all of them there is no how that is why we're here to debunk them to tell all those ladies that i have mentioned the word powers they should warn all those people because what they could not begin to say things they don't know a place they never been before a place they never been before they don't even know what is happening there today as i'm speaking to you people they don't know how many people die there every single day they don't even know but they are now telling you that hope who's a man they had they, they, they haven't saw him before they never met this man before they never met him but they are there because they are white people some black people join them someone that put on suit trying to address people like they say you know these people that is why we will keep on listening to them they will keep on telling us our story and we will be there listening to them great people this is what i bring to you today for you people to know that the problem we have is not only in our land but all over the whole world don't want us to restore our land and they will keep on suppressing us they will keep on beating us at the same time knocking us on our on our head when we speak they will tell you keep quiet but we are not going to keep quiet anymore we are going to be telling the world the way the, the way it is that these people meant no good for us they want us all to die so that they will keep on sucking milking our resources with that end and that is something that we have asked Kabiyama to forgive us our sin and let us go back to our root and we are about to go back to our root by the end all of them will bow and say that we know what we are doing hope those of them you will never die well I'm telling the world that hope who's of them is the most deadless human or deadless governor have ever emerged or still reeling today killing his own people maiming them and destroying all their properties because he want to be in power now you understand I greet you all. Good day and welcome.